Okay, so Krishan got arrested. Krishan Rock showed up to court Monday to support Blueface, but ended up being arrested on her own charges while she was there. How you doing? Lady, you know about that, don't you? No, I don't. Why? Don't include me in that. You talking to him. Don't include me in that. Hold on tight, because this celebrity drama is about to get wild. Jaden Alexis is over the moon as her ex, Blueface, and his on-again, off-again flame, Chrissy and Rock, face serious legal woes. Chrissy and just got busted walking into court with her baby, slapped with a felony fugitive warrant, and Blueface isn't faring any better, bouncing in and out of jail. While these two are tangled up in scandal, Jaden is living her best life in a sizzling new relationship. What's the real tea behind this love triangle turned courtroom chaos? Stick around to find out all the juicy details. I didn't come, we didn't come in here to minimize. We came in here to say that the negotiation is reasonable and the court should follow it. Things are truly spiraling for Blueface and Christian Rock. Blueface, whose real name is Jonathan Porter, is serving time until July 2024 after violating his probation, a consequence stemming from a violent altercation with a bouncer in 2021. But that's not the only thing keeping him behind bars. His involvement in a shooting outside a Las Vegas strip club in October 2022 added another layer of legal trouble. Outside a Vegas nightclub when a white pickup truck drives by. He then pulls out his gun and fires multiple shots in the driver's direction, who swerves across the road while trying to dodge the bullet. Despite initially dodging a long sentence through a plea deal, his probation violation brought the hammer down, ensuring he's not stepping out of jail anytime soon. One can only wonder what was going through Blueface's mind as he found himself embroiled in these repeated acts of violence. Perhaps the company he kept, including the tumultuous relationship with Chrissy and Rock, fueled these reckless decisions. With the rapper now behind bars, life in jail isn't as bleak as one might expect. Sources reveal he's kept out of the general population and enjoys a variety of commissary options, from hot cheese crunchies to bear claws. Not exactly a life of luxury, but certainly a cut above the average inmate's experience. He even has access to education and religious services, alongside ample time to connect with his family and lawyers. It's almost as if the system is preparing him for a smoother transition back to civilian life. But will it be enough? Hello, my name is Yamu Salam from Burnsville, Maryland. And seeing stuff like this pisses me off because it's like a case of a celebrity going crazy with their ego. Meanwhile, Chrissy and Rock's legal battles are just as dramatic, if not more so. Her assault on a backup dancer during Tamar Braxton's show landed her a 30-day jail sentence and 12 months probation. But the real kicker? She's set to be extradited to Oklahoma to face substance charges. What happened, Christine? I don't know, this thing, I got a whole nother case. Her life has turned into a relentless cycle of courtroom appearances and jail stints, all while she tries to maintain some semblance of a relationship with her child. In a heartfelt yet defiant Instagram live session, Christine expressed her determination to stay out of jail for her son's sake. I'm doing every way possible to get that figured out without even trying to serve time and it's working out for me, so. Yet her actions suggest a woman trapped in a storm of legal troubles and personal demons. The sight of her being led away in handcuffs, defiantly claiming she never even goes downtown where the latest charges were pressed, paints a picture of a life constantly under siege. Despite these setbacks, there's a glimmer of hope. WAC 100, Blueface's manager, remains optimistic about Christian's situation, suggesting she might be out before the summer ends and back to her son soon. Rashawn has, I believe, two, three warrants. Uh, one of them not serious. Arizona's not serious. Um, California's not serious. However, it's a race against time as the legal system grinds on, potentially keeping her away from her child for longer than anticipated. Will she manage to break free from this cycle, or will her legal woes continue to overshadow her life and career? As if this courtroom drama wasn't enough, Blueface faces a staggering $13 million judgment related to the Las Vegas strip club shooting. The club sued him for being a nuisance leading to its closure. The judgment includes lost revenue, lease payments, and outstanding payrolls, a financial hit that would cripple even the most robust bank accounts. One can't help but question how will Blueface navigate this financial disaster on top of his existing legal troubles. I told you I was coming here. What? Whack. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. That whack. Meanwhile, Jaden Alexis is seemingly thriving amidst this chaos. Her social media is a constant stream of enviable moments, from lavish vacations to intimate dates with her new beau. It's almost as if she's living a parallel universe, untouched by the turmoil surrounding her ex and his on-again, off-again partner. Could it be that Jaden has finally found the peace and stability that eluded her during her time with Blueface? I mean, Jaden, were you okay with it? Were you okay with him doing that? I mean, go crazy. 
Go crazy, okay. While Blueface is tangled in a web of legal troubles and drama with Chrissy and Rock, Jaden Alexis is busy reshaping her life, far removed from the chaos. Recently, Jaden confirmed she's single and focusing on herself this year. She's stepping out of the shadows of her tumultuous past and into a more self-assured future. Maybe? No, I mean, no, I'm yeah. chilling. I'm chilling right now. You're chilling right now, okay. Getting the money, yeah, you feel me? Getting the money, okay. During a New Year's Eve interview, she was clear about her goals, stating she wants to become better and is all about getting this money now. But what really caught everyone's attention was her candid revelation about the end of her engagement with Blueface. It turns out he proposed to her not out of love, but merely to make her happy amid the ongoing drama with Chrissy and Rock. Oh my God! Oh my God. Oh my God. Blueface's admission that he proposed to Jaden to make her happy is a bombshell. He suggested that she never truly liked him and drew a parallel between her actions and those of Christian, saying Jaden started acting like Christian. Whoa! I don't believe in marriage, but... What? I love her. This comment adds another layer to their already complicated relationship. Blueface openly stated he wasn't any happier about their situation at the time of the proposal and had hoped that it might improve things between them. However, his efforts seem to be in vain as their relationship continued to deteriorate. As the dust settles, Jaden appears to be the one who has emerged from the chaos stronger. Her social media presence is a testament to her newfound independence and joy. Amidst the legal chaos surrounding her ex, she's been spotted living her best life, whether it's traveling to exotic locations or cozying up with her new love interest, Jocelyn Morris. This new relationship has been quite the talk of the town, especially since Jaden and Jocelyn were seen getting quite cozy at a club, locking lips multiple times. Jocelyn, a former women's basketball player who now creates content focusing on the LGBTQ community, has been quite open about her feelings for Jaden. Despite their brief split a few months ago, Jocelyn expressed nothing but love and admiration for Jaden, stating she wants her to be happy. I don't, I don't, you don't know that. I hope that she does get treated right because she really does deserve it, honestly. Like, she's genuinely a really cool and nice person. This rekindled romance seems to be just what Jaden needed to close the Blueface chapter for good. And if that's who makes her happy, then who am I to, like, like I, I'm, then I'm happy for her. Interestingly, this romantic resurgence comes on the heels of some rather ironic events. Despite Blueface's claims and the turmoil of their past, Jaden's newfound peace and happiness suggests she's indeed moved on. It's almost poetic how she's finding love and stability while Blueface and Creasy continue to spiral. Jocelyn, too, is part of this new narrative, having declared her support for Jaden openly. Their public displays of affection and mutual support paint a picture of a relationship that is both passionate and supportive. One can't help but wonder, though, how will Blueface react to seeing Jaden thriving without him? His recent statements suggest a man grappling with the consequences of his actions, yet there's little indication he's ready to let go of the past. As for Christian, her path to redemption seems fraught with challenges. Can she break free from the cycle of legal troubles and personal demons to build a stable life for herself and her son? Amidst the turmoil, it's fascinating to see how Jaden, who once seemed inseparable from Blueface, has distanced herself entirely. This pivot is all the more intriguing as Christian Rock, now facing her own legal battles, finds unexpected allies in Blueface's circle. Christian's sister has launched a GoFundMe to raise money for legal fees, highlighting the desperation and urgency within their family. They're struggling to access Christian's funds, relying instead on the generosity of her fans. This move speaks volumes about the dire circumstances and the lengths they're willing to go to support her. But the most shocking twist comes from Blueface's mother, Carlissa Saffold, who has historically clashed with Christian. In a surprising turn, she's publicly voiced her support for Christian, condemning the timing of her arrest as a bit much. I absolutely did not know what was going to happen. Um, but Carlissa even went as far as to reach out to Kim Kardashian for help, a move that has left everyone stunned. Can you imagine Kim Kardashian stepping into this saga to advocate for Christian's release? It seems almost too wild to be true, yet it perfectly encapsulates the unpredictable nature of this ongoing drama. I was at the time, she had her kid and she was there supporting my son, so I don't agree with it. Even though I'm not a fan and, and we have our differences, I think that was a bit much. Carlissa's sudden support begs the question, is this a genuine change of heart or a strategic move to align with public sentiment? Her insistence that she had no part in the police intervention and her call for a higher profile rescue attempt suggest a deeper strategy at play. Could it be that Carlissa sees a PR opportunity here, a chance to reposition herself as a supportive figure rather than an antagonist? It's absolutely insane. It's not something I would do, 
Um, if I'm getting into it with my mother-in-law, that has nothing to do with the kids, and it shouldn't have anything to do with the kids, even if I while Krizian's legal troubles intensify, her son remains with a family friend, Marsha, respecting Krizian's wishes. This decision underscores the strained yet resilient nature of their familial relationships. It's clear that despite past conflicts, there's an underlying desire to ensure the child's well-being. Marsha has him. Uh, Marsha's a really, really loyal friend to her, and honestly, the baby is in good care with Marsh. Like I However, Christian's ability to stay out of jail remains precarious, with her extradition to Oklahoma looming large. The community's outcry and the family's desperate measures to secure her freedom reflect a broader narrative of struggle and resilience. In this swirling maelstrom of legal woes, financial disasters, and unexpected alliances, the future remains uncertain for Blueface and Christian. Yet, amidst the chaos, Jaden's narrative serves as a beacon of transformation and resilience. Her ability to rebuild and thrive away from the drama encapsulates the potential for redemption and new beginnings, even as the storm rages on for those she left behind. As we wrap up this intense saga, we can't help but wonder will Blueface and Christian Rock ever find their way out of this legal labyrinth, or are they destined to be ensnared in controversy forever? And what about Jade and Alexis? Will her newfound peace and stability last, or is there more drama lurking around the corner? We want to hear your thoughts. Drop your comments below and let us know what you think about this wild celebrity triangle. Thanks for tuning in and until next time, stay curious.